welcome to Tales of Honor Podcast, a podcast dedicated to telling the true stories of every recipient of the Medal of Honor. Hello, everyone, and welcome to today's episode of Tales of Honor Podcast. I'm your host, Christoph Ambrose, and today we'll be going over episode number 365. I have two birthdays to go over today. First up was yesterday, the 5th of December, 1945. Donald Doc Ballard turned 75 years old. Doc is a former colonel in the United States Navy who received the Medal of Honor for his actions during the Vietnam War. So a very happy birthday to Doc Ballard. And the other birthday I have to go over is actually tomorrow's birthday, December 7th, 1941. Ronald Ray will be turning 79 years old. He is a former lieutenant colonel in the U.S. Army who received the Medal of Honor for his actions during the Vietnam War as well. So a very happy birthday to Ronald Ray and once again to Doc Ballard. That's all I have for birthdays today. Let's move right on into today's Tale of Honor. William was born in Somerset, Ohio on the 1st of March, 1848, and he enlisted in the 4th Iowa Cavalry as a private on the 21st of March, 1864, at the age of 16. He was mustered out shortly after the Civil War ended, and he then entered the U.S. Military Academy, graduating West Point on the 15th of June, 1870, and was commissioned as a second lieutenant. William went on to the artillery school, where he became the honor graduate in 1873, and was promoted to first lieutenant in 1879. In addition to teaching natural and experimental philosophy, he also was a judge advocate for the Department of Columbia, which was a military division of the Pacific States. William was promoted to captain in 1898, and it was his actions on the 13th of May, 1899, with the 3rd U.S. Artillery in Luzon that would earn him the Medal of Honor. The citation reads, With 12 men charged and routed 300 of the enemy. William was promoted to Colonel of Volunteers shortly after, and then to Major of Regular Army in 1901. He received his Medal of Honor on the 15th of July, 1902, and would reach the rank of Brigadier General the day before his retirement on the 16th of February, 1906. William and his wife Geraldine had one daughter that I could find, and Edith had two sons, Williston and Charles Palmer, that would both go on to serve in the U.S. Army during World War II and the Korean War, and both became four-star generals. William Edward Berkheimer died on the 10th of June, 1914, at the age of 66, and is buried with his wife in Arlington National Cemetery, Section 1, Grave 339. And that was a tale of honor. Thank you for listening to Tales of Honor Podcast. Head on over to talesofhonorpodcast.com where you can read these stories, see other ways to support the show, and easily share a story with your friends and family. Tales of Honor Podcast is written and produced by Christoph Ambrosch, and theme song, A New Beginning, is by Ben Sound. If you have any questions or comments, you can send them to talesofhonorpodcast at gmail.com. And until next time, I'm Christoph Ambrosch. Thanks for listening. Thanks for listening.